Are the blues weighing you down? Let's find some light together. In our journey through life, we all face moments that test our spirits. But what if you could find a source of comfort and strength? Join us as Mufti Menk shares profound, heartfelt guidance to lift your spirits and guide you through the shadows. If you take a look at the books of history and the scriptures, the Old Testament, the Quran, whatever else it may be, you will find that there was a period of time of hardship after which the ease came. Take a look at the story of the Prophet Joseph. May peace be upon him. They had hardship. They had drought. Did it last forever and ever? How many years did it last? Tell me. Someone said seven years, didn't they? Correct. You deserve a medal, my sister. I think I heard seven years. Did someone say seven years at the back? Mashallah. You deserve another medal. The only person interacting here, man. And after that, Allah gave them ease. So Allah does not keep you down all the time. Don't lose hope. While you're down, just bear it. You will be down for a while. I promise you in a year, two years, three years, five years, seven years. Do you know what will happen? Within those years, your life will change to the degree that you will look back and say, Whew, I was about to give up at one stage. I know of business people, people who are unwell, people who are going through medical problems, you know, Family matters. Sometimes you're going through a divorce and you know what? You went through it once. It was so painful. You desperately do not want to go through it again. But unfortunately, it's coming. Let it happen. Let it be. No problem. Divorce is never the end of the world. It might just be the beginning of your life. I went through a divorce myself many, many years back. In fact, when the brother earlier was saying, I've been listening to Mufti Menk for about 15 years. Did you hear him say that? The first time I actually said, gosh, I'm old, man. Mashallah, it's true. It's very true, brother. I kicked off in 1999. That's 21 years ago. Subhanallah. My kids are in their 20s. Some of them are married. You wouldn't even believe that. And I'm not lying, by the way. Okay. So subhanallah, it's amazing, my brothers and sisters, how there will come a time when ease will come through. You go through a divorce. You're not the first person. You will never be the last one. It may not be your first divorce. You might go through it again and again. And who knows, the third, the fourth person you're going to get to through marriage is going to be, wow, the king of your dreams. Subhanallah, it can happen. And then you can let the other three know that, by the way, anyway, you don't need to do that. Okay. But man is such that when we're going through the issue, it's the end of the world. It's not just ride this for now. You know, the waves are coming in. Just ride the wave for now. And you lay low for a little while. Thank Allah. Develop your relationship with Allah. A day will come when you will have the last laugh. And always, as they say, he who laughs last, laughs the best. You have the best laugh. That's a good concept. It's true. It's actually true. <laughs>